latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Kate Lacanute with 41 Action News. Here's a look at your headlines. The first games of the Big 12 Men's Basketball Conference Tournament Championship tip off tonight. And the T-Mobile Center will be open to fans, but just some of them. Fans must wear masks. There are two to eight seats in a pod with a six foot radius between groups. There are also entire rows blocked off. So again, it is not at full capacity. There are limits. Tickets, meanwhile, are digital, meaning on your phone, not paper tickets. Also today, the U.S. House voted to approve the $1.9 trillion COVID relief bill. Now the bill heads to the president's desk. He is expected to sign it on Friday. It does include that $1,400 direct payment to Americans making under $75,000 as well as expanding unemployment benefits and billions for struggling states, schools and small businesses. Owners of a now closed Missouri Christian girls home in custody for combined 102 charges. Boyd and Stephanie Householder are accused of abusing at least 16 girls who attended the Circle of Hope Girls Ranch. The boarding school is located near Humansville, Missouri, south of Kansas City. It opened in 2006 and shut down last year. The Missouri Attorney General Eric Schmidt shared today that Boyd faces 80 charges, his wife 22. We believe this to be one of the most widespread cases of sexual, physical and mental abuse patterns against young girls and women in Missouri history. The Attorney General's office is continually working to identify and contact victims and urges anyone who has any information to contact the office at 573-751-0309. Now here's Wes with the forecast. Thunderstorms are coming through this evening, some of which may produce strong wind gusts and quarter size hail. Time frame about 7 o'clock through about 11 o'clock with most of the rainfall and the best chance of severe weather are actually south of Kansas City. More rainfall for the next week. You can get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.